Alright. What's happening, everybody? So, it's time to get this started. Try and make this part a little bit longer than last time. So, during the intro, I was playing on uh, the controller, and I found out that that was pretty garbage, so I switched back to my keyboard and mouse. So, I'm going to have to learn the controls again. We need to talk. I attacked this archipelago with a man named Juan Cortes. He helped me build Libertad from the dirt. Juan's a spy master from the pre-Castillo days. Can build an ICBM from a goddamn ice cube tray. Pulled off ops for Espinosa, the KGB, then flipped to the CIA and Mossad for fun. Juan is my mentor. He's also unstable and an alcoholic. When shit went south, he was so embarrassed he walked straight out of my camp. Castillo soldados would love nothing more than to capture a double agent like Cortez. I need him back with neighbor Dad, Danny. He's done with us, but you're a fresh face. Take this earpiece. Juan made them for comms, then head to the village. If I were you, I would check the bar first. Get down to that village and bring me Cortez. I hope for your sake he's sober. Can you hear me okay? Loud and clear. This spy shit works, Clara. I'll give you that. Bien. Keep your gun holstered if you want to stay out of trouble. Especially in areas with a lot of soldados. Si. I got it. A smart guerrilla picks their battles. Suerte. Why are you doing this? Papers. I don't have them on me, senora. No papers? That's a serious offense. Disculpa. I must have left them at home. I'm going to have to report. Hey. Good boy. Today we drink in the worst fucking cantina in Yara. Or is it Colombia? Kirat, Chechnya. Leave the bottle. Let's work for you. Nada. Guapo, you listen. Rule 16. A guerrero's revolution never ends. 
Always another war, another cantina, another ugly bartender. Juan Cortez. What do you think gave it away, Wapo? This isn't a fucking zoo, abuelo. Clara sent me to find you. See, I learned long ago never to doubt her. You will too. Hey, I know you. Don't think so. Yeah, I know you. It's like I'm looking at a mirror, Wapo. What are you talking about? Those eyes, guerrilla. You got a taste. You convince yourself you're a hero, but you wake up a junkie, just like Juan Cortez. This is a fucking waste of time. Can you whistle? What? Nah, you can't whistle. You fucking rat. You were more dead anyway. What the fuck? See, Guapo is in love with you. And I ruined the only copy of my book. Bueno, mis socios, vámonos. Once again, we have outstayed our welcome. Shows up. 
I'm drunk, but I'm not that drunk. Right behind you, old man. Wapo wants to be your friend. Or maybe he just needs to take a dump. Only one way to find out. Come on, let's get the fuck out of here. Stop fucking around, we got business. I can tell you handled a gun before. What's your name? Danny. So Clara says you're a legend. Ex-KGB, ex-CIA. <laughs> I got more fucking exes than your porn search history. Some men, they break eggs for breakfast. But Juan Cortez, he breaks fucking countries. Hold up. New plan, Danny. Vamos. The plan is to go back to Clara's camp. Where the hell are we going now? See that smoke? That means the watchtower just got a supply drop with some of the rarest materials you'll find in Yara. And you are going to go get it. Now you want me to steal shit for you? Gunpowder and Supremo Bond. The Cerveza and Chaser of Resolver. I'm gonna teach you to make shit for weapons. Because making shit for weapons is cool. And it's rule number nine. Always use the right tool for the right job. You coming with me? Fuck no. You got Guapo. You can tear shit up with him. But if you wanna be sneaky, leave him behind. That cutie loves to make a mess. At least you're here to help Wapo. Weapon or not, the military will shoot me on sight here. Go! You can't be here! Go!
Let's get four one. What the hell are you going to do with this? This is more like it. I attended a funeral today. One of our soldiers. Found all your shit, Juan. Good work, Danny. Now hurry up already. We need to get back to Clara's camp. That's what I've been saying. must be refreshed from time to time with the blood of Patriot. Okay, we got more than enough. Let's get the fuck out of here. So what's with all of this junk? Building something? Huh? Listen to Juan. So what's with all of this junk? You building something? Patience, Danny. Rule number eight. A guerrilla knows how to wait. Like a spider or a serial killer. So, how did you get to this godforsaken hellhole? I was on a refugee ship. We didn't get far. Yeah, yeah. I came here on a chopper in our baby invasion of Santuario. Shot straight out of the goddamn sky. No, I mean, what's your story? The orphanage in Esperanza. Then the military. I'm no guerrilla. Just helping Clara out until she gets me off this island. Rule 20. Once a guerrilla, always a guerrilla. Enough with that shit. Too late. The horse is out of the barn, and now the fucking cocaine is all over the kids, daddy. There is no other option. America is my option. <laughs> of course. And you think Americans want your Yaran blood? The American dream is for Americans, Danny. You don't quit, do you? Nope. Wapo hates quitters. Coño. If you two are so close, why is he following me? Wapo goes with those who need him most. Like those therapy dogs in your precious America. You can trust Wapo with your life. Yeah. Not sure I'm there yet. You got time. You said your chopper was shot down in the invasion. Can you fix it? So I can fly you to the Yankees? No, that's... It's grounded. But I'm working on it. Patience, Danny. Now it's time for Juan Cortez to show you how to make something out of nothing. Did I ever tell you rule number nine? You just did. Always use the right tool for the right job. Words to live by. Okay. How many others? The legend returns. The legend needs to piss, Hefa. Who's she? She was a journalist who dared call Anton Fascista. Now she's an outcast, a slave for his paradise. And she's not the only one, Danny. The time you learn about resolver, Danny. When I was six, I rigged my first bike with a chainsaw motor. The blockade means I have to resolver every day, Juan. Nah, that's survival. For a guerrilla, resolver isn't just making do with what you have. It's inflicting chaos with everything you've got. Keep talking. A guerrilla's best weapon is the workbench. Go ahead, Danny. Get... Let's take a crack at those weapons. No offense, but your battle rifle is a little basic. Let's fix that. Rule number nine, always use the right tool for the Sometimes right... Sometimes I lie awake at night asking myself, what? Excellent, Danny. Now you can pop enemy flesh like a ripe watermelon. Okay, let's look at your other rifle. Let's say your target remembered to wear their helmet and vest today. You're gonna need these rounds, fly straight and through, and go through Kevlar like shit through a goose. Nice! Now you got your own supply of high-velocity war crimes. Let's look at your attachments. Time to make your very first suppressor. This will turn a bang into a bang. See how easy that was? Now you can silently headshot your enemies like a real asshole. The workbench is your friend, Danny. A friend with benefits. 
Go see with it. Damn. Making shit is addictive. With that workbench, you can build a new yada. Feel like taking Wapo for a walk? Danny, I've got big plans for you. But first, I need you to get a thing for me. Now, I hear you ask, Juan, what is this thing you need? All you need to know is don't try to eat it, talk to it, or put it in your pants. But Juan, I hear you ask, where is this thing you need? Head for the radio tower and follow the trail north. It'll take you to an abandoned camp on the east side of the island. I can mark it on your map. You'll meet my contact there. She'll hook you up. And Danny, if you pull this off, I'm gonna give you something for pulling me from the bottle. A little gift an old friend gave me for saving his life. Not that you saved my life, just... I get the fuck out of here. Easy as smoking a cigar on Sunday. You better be here to help us. <clears throat> Fuerte. Se vola. This room. I gotta take this. Lo siento. Keep it in one piece, okay? I've been through enough of them in Esperanza.
sabias palabras de nuestro Why did it put me way over here? What? <clears throat> um. Can't fast travel while in combat. There is a wall to my Maybe that'll reason on me. Okay. Watch yourself, Danny. Great. We have all heard the name Outcast. This name is a lie. This name is an injustice to the Yara. Check that out! Vamos! This is where I started the game at. was a stupid glitch. It's like, hey, I'm gonna fall through the map now and teleport you all the way across the entire map. Hey, a horse. <laughs> Shit, I haven't ridden a horse since basic training. This place has a stash room.
Juan, the checkpoint is clear. Didn't that feel good? You earned some guerrilla karma today. Keep it up, Danny. I found the tower. Don't stop now, Danny. Find the guerrilla path and follow it to my contact. See, si. I'm on my way. Juan described you pretty well. My name is Raisa, and I'm going to be helping you steal shit from Castillo today. Are you going to tell me what I'm stealing? Depleted uranium. <laughs> Perdon. I thought... You heard me. Look, all I know is I burned my last contact in the army tracking it down for Juan. You ex-military? Isn't everybody? Okay. You show me where it is. First, you take this parachute. Trust me, it can save your life. Now I'll take you to the old Spanish fort. They've got it locked up inside. Conscript or volunteer? Conscript. My number came up, so I did my time. You? Volunteer. All I wanted to be was a soldier. You know, wear the uniform, serve my country. Found out the only kind of soldier Castillo wants is a blind fascist addicted to his every word. So now you're a traitor. Yeah, and I'm not the only one. There's a guard posted at the watchtower ahead. He's going to let us use it to scout out the fort. He can also give us useful info. What does he want from us? One, not to get his ass shot. So keep your gun holstered or he'll open fire. Two, a little bribe to these double agents will get us military intel. Right. No weapons. Pesos ready. There he is. Hope you got some pesos on you. What do you got? Okay, check this out. Here's where you can find some weapons around here. Thanks a million. Sure. Whatever you and Raisa are about to do, I don't want to be around for it. Everyone's got their price. Not every soldier's a fanatic. Some are just trying to feed their families. Just remember to put the guns away before you approach them. Use your phone to scout out enemy soldiers and see their weaknesses. I bet Juan's already giving you his right tool for the right job talk. Where is the officer in charge? Alvarez has the key to the armory. Careful, Danny. He's higher rank. 
in Castillo's army. That means he's better trained, quicker with the trigger, and a tough motherfucker. This fort is the most protected base on the island. These soldiers have been issued with body armor and helmets. Nothing armor piercing rounds can't handle. Use the workbench if you need to craft some, and then go snatch that uranium, Danny. That parachute I gave could come in handy here. Just don't drop into the middle of the fort, okay? inside. The key 
He should get me Juan's uranium. The uranium. Juan, you didn't fucking tell me I was stealing uranium. It was supposed to be a surprise. Now bring it back to me. What if this shit kills me? It's depleted uranium, Danny. Stop being such a pussy. Oye, Juan. <laughs> this is Resolver, Danny. Depleted uranium. Soviets left these sexy byproducts of nuclear enrichment behind in the 80s. Yankees use it for tank armor and bullets. <laughs> Crazy assholes. Sounds dangerous. You'll be a fucking superhero, Danny. Lita and I used to sneak these into the orphanage. Essential reading while waiting to fuck up convoys in the mud. A guerrilla must be a sponge for inspiration. Okay, but what the hell is this? This is a Supremo. Looks like a rocket launcher. See, si, she does that too. One more thing. I want you to meet Tostador. The two go together like fire and fury. I like how you reserve air, Juan. So do I. Hola. Y voila. Supremos are like a good lover. Or a great sandwich. Are you just hungry, Juan? Yes. But I'm talking about layers, Danny. Head to the workbench and I'll show you. Supremos aren't just simple tools of... Let's take a look at that Supremo. The special ingredient that makes this all happen is Supremo Bond. You need it to make your gadgets. Pick a gadget, Danny. This is a safe space. There's no wrong answer here. Excellent. Now go talk to Clara. Time to give that Supremo a workout.
Oye, compadre. Now go talk to Clara. Time to put that Supremo to use, guerrilla. We need to talk. I don't need to tell you that Viviro is the lifeblood of Castillo's regime. He's built work camps to produce it all over Yara. These plantations use outcasts as slaves to grow the tobacco plants they turn into Viviro. These are our people, Danny. Beaten, tortured, sprayed by poison chemicals. There's a camp on this island. We tried to destroy it when we invaded. We failed. Now we're going to finish the job. Julio is waiting for you at a nearby barn. Hit that slave camp hard. Suerte. Yeah, but do you? What do I look like? A fucking triada priest? I can't predict the future. But history is on our side. A history could never stop the bullet. Even if we. If we get through. Castillo's got 300,000 troops waiting for us on the other side. Supremo. Now, if things get too heavy with the soldados, just pull the trigger. But one tiny, tiny thing you should know. Uh-huh. The Supremos are in an experimental phase. They need time to breathe after you use them. You know, so they don't overload and kill you. Could have told me before I strap one to my back. Just let that Supremo feed off the blood of your enemies. What? <laughs> You'll get it, Danny. I'm a friend. Listen, I'm not going to bullshit you. I wanted to do this alone, but Clara gave me an order. I can handle myself. Don't give a shit. So could Lita. She should be here right now, but instead I get you. And I'm supposed to be a Miami. But instead my two best friends are dead, and I'm stuck here with you. So, truce? Enough talk. Step one, we hit the tobacco. Step two, we destroy their poison supply. Step three, we get the fuck out of there, and Castillo gets a nice pretty message from Libertad. Got it. Take this gear. He'll protect you from fire, and more importantly, Castillo's fucking poison.
using the right protective gear in the right situation will keep you alive. Yeah, the right tool for the right job. Been hearing that a lot lately. Listen, Julio. Lita was like a sister to me. She shouldn't have been on that fucking boat. She died because of you, Rojas. No. Anton Castillo killed Lita. If I could change anything, it would be me dying on that beach. Lita was a better person than I could ever be. And if she loved you, well, that just says a lot about who you are. Enough. Look, if you and I are going to do this, you need to know about the poison. You mean that shit they spray on Elise? Its real name is PG-240, but we call it the poison because it fucked up your system. Try not to breathe it or get it on your skin. It can make you go fucking crazy or sick, like deep down sick. And if that doesn't get you, the cancer that grows inside you will. Coño. So you're military. Marksman? Close us all? What's your thing? I'm good with guns. We get along. We'll start thinking. That gear I gave you is good for fire and poison, but guerrillas need gear that fits their style, no matter the situation, or they get themselves killed. This is a good place to scout it. Right behind you. Let's see what we're up against. Up here, Dali. Should disable the alarm. See the Viviro tobacco and the yellow poison tanks? See. Si. Punch holes in the tanks to let the poison out into the air. Fun fact. Poison and fire make a hell of a mix. Big boom. Same idea with the fumigators. They're hard to kill, but they can't take the heat. You've got a flamethrower. You've got that Supremo. Time to fuck up all this Viviro bullshit. You know... Lita and I had a ritual. Psych us up before battle. A song. Hit me. El movimiento de libertad. Oh, bella ciao, bella ciao. Bella ciao, ciao, ciao. <laughs> For Lita. For Lita. Let's make some chaos, Danny. We'll burn this fucking place to the ground. Where I hear music. Uh. 
nuestra lucha continuará. Y si me muero, caeré muriendo. my way.
you really can hold your own. I don't want to say I told you so, but... Look, we should move. That was a hell of a light show, and they're going to see the smoke. We work well together. See, si. Listen, if you were good with Lita, you're good with me. Gracias, Danny. Meet you back at camp. Well, I'm going to go ahead and try and wrap it up here. Um, usually going to try and keep the parks around an hour long or so. So that way they're at least somewhat watchable. So I'm probably going to film a part two almost immediately because I'm having fun with it. So after I stop this stream slash recording, I'll probably immediately start another one. We'll see how it goes. So anyway, if you stuck with me, thanks for watching. And, uh, Check me out.